Hello and welcome to Old Lady Plays. I'm Kate, the Old Lady, and this is The Loyal, episode 37 of the San Diego Loyal Save. And here we are. Hello! It's time to have a look at a news item. The news item is the one reviewing the U.S. League Cup which was won by Real Salt Lake over Columbus. Columbus, of course, beat us on penalties in the in the final, or with a late extra time goal, was it? Something like that, anyway. But uh, biggest overachievers, San Diego Loyal. So, Harry, yay us. We're biggest overachievers. That's exciting. There was another interesting one coming up, too. Yes, 200 games in management with tonight's match which is going to be Inter-Miami. Um, it's a big game, so I'm, I'm looking forward to it. And let's have a quick peek at how things have been going. You last saw us lose to Columbus in extra time in the um, League Cup semi-final. We lost 2-1 to Kansas City on a late goal. Uh, we won 3-1 over Real Salt Lake with goals throughout the game. We were never not leading in this game. Um, once we took the lead, we stayed with it. And Cincinnati, we managed to come back and get a draw with them after a, after a late, um, what do you call it? After a late charge, we were pushing hard to get it. And I, this, I, wanted, I want you to see this goal because this goal was outrageous. I was so proud of my team for this goal. All right, pass, 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 goal. Is that sweet? Three one-touch passes, and the ball's in the net. Ah, oh. oh, he's so good, McAtee. He's been so good for us, and unfortunately, he's going to join Cincinnati or Columbus or somebody next season, unfortunately. But, you know, that's life. Um, it's unfortunate. I wish we could have bought him, but we didn't. So, um, I didn't realize he was for sale, to be honest. I didn't think he was. I thought that was why he was on loan. So it doesn't look like we've done very well, but honestly, I think we really have. We also played New York City, and again, they lost. They beat us on a late goal. Um, we had come back to tie it up with I was a goal I was very happy with and then they got one in the 82nd minute and we just we tried and tried and tried but we couldn't quite come back um, that was very frustrating they also had a penalty in the 90 oh no was that that was the Cincinnati match they had a penalty in the 95th minute I think it was all right, it's not gonna let me see it right now. You don't wanna, you don't, you don't wanna let me see the. I, I don't want. No, that's not what. It doesn't matter. Never mind. Anyway, so that's how things have been going. Um, overall, I'm pretty happy. We are fourteenth mm, in the league, and as long as we don't lose today, we won't lose that spot. Um. We should be able to, I hope, with a little bit of luck, if we got a decent win, we could actually end up in 12th. So, you know, it's it's not impossible. And Inter-Miami are only 11th. So, you know, it's, it's not an impossible dream. Uh, we do have one player out today, so Yusuf of Bob can come in, and Salduco can come in for him. And Fromont is not well, so let's bring in Diego Norales. No, we don't really need Norales. How about Joe Gallardo? Somebody who's become, unfortunately, less important to us this year as we've moved away from playing wingers. So, um, wow, there's a lot of goal mistakes being made by the guys on my bench. That's interesting, isn't it? Look at that. These are goal mistakes. 
Or, no, game is missed. Okay. Ooh, I thought that was... These are goal mistakes. Okay, that makes more sense. So that's a lot of goal mistakes, especially by people on my bench. But that's... It's game's missed. That, that makes a lot more sense. All right, enough goofing around. I, it's time to get on with this game. Get on with this game. That's what we're doing. The team today is Knight, Lacvecchiani, Garibay, Leone, and Kuchin, Bob, McAtee, Squizzato, Aquala behind Bennett and Vega. Rubin is injured. He's out for three to four weeks, which is to say for the rest of the season. And uh, Bennett is in. Now, Bennett has bagged 10 goals for us this year off the bench, mostly. And uh, I'm kind of hopeful that he's going to keep developing and, and becoming a better and better player. Uh, la, 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 la. Fans? No, there's no fans here. We're in their park. In Miami, no way we got any fans here. All right, we'll try this. Oh, total demotivation. Oh no, I screwed that up. <laughs> ah, I screwed that up badly. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Uh, it's a big loss, and I don't like knowing we won't have him available. Yeah. It is a big loss. He's an important piece of our playing style. Let's see how we do, though. We are capable of playing with these guys. We just drew Cincinnati, and they were in seventh place at the time. These guys are four places below that. Oh, look at that pass. Vega, no, nice try. Ah, oh, nice try, nice try. High ball, and it goes over everybody. Oh, what a save. Tips it onto the bar. Cleared with a good header. Always press. We'll do that. Bakvakiliani. McAtee gets it back to Bakvakiliani. Oh, Bennett! Bennett scores! 1-0 San Diego. Ken Bennett's 11th goal of the season. Rubio who? Oh, I shouldn't say that. We all love Rubio Rubin. He's a goal machine. That was very fortunate, really. The ball just sort of bounced off Lafreciliani back to Bennett, and he buried it. Good for him. We're up to 13th. Now we just have to hope 12th place doesn't win, doesn't draw, so that they can stay back and we can get ahead of them too. Come on, 12th place, don't win. All right, we're going well so far. I'm happy. Hey, look, they're motivated this time. Yay. At least I didn't demotivate everybody. That was really funny. Terrible, but funny. I think that's the worst team talk I've ever given. The full team demotivation. Oh, just over the bar. McAtee's looking pretty bagged. Whoa, good clearance. Alright, I'm going to get 
get some fresh legs in the midfield. Valentino Salduco. Uh, we can help you take Squizzato's place. That works. And that's going to be it for changes that I'm willing to make. Everybody else can suffer. Good save, good save, I'm all night getting in there with his hands, body behind the ball, good technique, good save. Stolen and given away. Hate that. Hate that. See? That's why I hate it. See it all again. Always press. Go on then. Come on, boys. It doesn't really matter. We're not going anywhere. If we end up in 14th, it's not exactly a terrible result. We were expected to fight bravely against relegation this season, and we've done that. And maybe more. Oh! Oh! <coughs> <laughs> Poor Vega can't buy a goal these days. He just cannot buy a break. Poor kid, look at the chance. Right at the end there. 1.41. Goal different. Or go expected goals. <sighs> yeah, they did well in avoiding defeat. I'm content with that. It's not great, but it's it's okay. Oh, that's left. That's unfortunately the thing. How do we rate the clash? I thought it was a good game. And 14th is where we finish. Minnesota United did drop back to 44 points, but unfortunately we couldn't get the two extra points we need and the one extra goal to have put us ahead of them. That's unfortunate, but that's okay. That is okay. We get 11.5 million for achieving 14th place. I think that might put us over 100 million. Oh, 99,623,000. How's that? So, not bad. Look at what we've done since we got to the Premier League. We're just accelerating up that slope and it just doesn't show any changes likely to come. 102 million, 125 million, 138 million. Wicked. Wicked. Transfer budget next season 58 million. Whoa. Wow, that would be something. Atlanta United are crowned champions, kind of expected that. I'll deal with that offline. There's a thing, and we've scouted somebody. Not consistent, but hey. Promising attacking midfielder, I'll say. That is a promising attacking midfielder, all right. It's too bad I've already got one in there. I wonder. What would he want? Okay, earn competition for places. Wage. Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna keep him now for this now, but um, that's a good chance. 
it's a good player there anyway i will come back next episode with uh, a brief end of seasons thing and um you know a transfer window start most likely and then um we'll review where the series is going and uh carry on with next season i expect because i we're, i remain loyal um haha so there you go i hope you've enjoyed the episode thank you very much for watching i do appreciate your time i hope you have a great day and take care <laughs>